32 weeks gestational age, multi pair female, and uh, hair. Uh, oh, sorry. So, uh, what we see is that this is the uh, urinary bladder, whereas the placenta is uh, showing uh, so no attachment. This is the serv This part is the cervix. This area. Excuse me. Now this area is the part of the cervix. It's not a bleed. And uh, from this angle. Now, okay. This is the cervix. Then this area, all of it from here in this section, uh, in this view, this is the placenta. And uh, this uh, rules out placenta being attached with the human bladder or <coughs> being, uh, let's see whether it's uh, in Krita or per Krita. Maybe, I don't know, let's have an ultrasound in the case of form. There, you see, this is now I have focused the uh, yeah, yes. Now this is the cervix and longitudinal section, this is the cervical canal, this is the internal rods, and this is all placenta. So it's placenta previa and it extends from the internal rods towards the uh, anterior wall. Okay, let's see uh, if there is any communication of the placenta with the uh, Urinary bladder wall. Well, yes, blood vessels are seen. This is also placenta. But now here, in longitudinal section, we do not see any communication of the placenta with the uh, wall of the urinary bladder in the lower portion, but in this region, in the anterior part, it does uh, the, uh, the wall of the urinary bladder shows uh, blood supply, which is a continuous with the placenta anterior part of this uh, placenta area, complete placenta area. See? Now this is the wall of the urinary bladder. Here is the placenta anterior part and we do see blood supply uh, that is uh, involving the urinary bladder wall as well. So now this is one view of the, uh, of the placenta. This is the second part. You see that the blood vessels in this region. But then let's see in this case See the uh, degree of uh, dilation of the legs, present legs. This is the head of the fetus. I have the enlarged of you. This is the head of the fetus. The rest of the scan is unremarkable. I have performed all of it. But uh, this is the area uh, to study in this particular case. Now this is cervix. This is the urinary bladder. This is the cervix. Internal loss is closed. You see the plug over here. And the placenta here is covering all up from the posterior wall. It comes to the cervix, the cervical area. And then ends up into the anterior wall, but there are very large uh, placental legs seen, and uh, otherwise we work very deep.
in front of you. Now this is uh, uh, regarding all of the placenta. I am going towards the top section of the placenta now. Let's see if it's graceful. Here we are. This is placenta, all of the placenta. Some we should even view. No evidence of increase or percrita in this region. Now this is placenta. This is all the placenta. So what is this placenta suggest you all? Here comes the head and uh, in a bit normal view, see the placenta now. And note you will see the movement of uh, fluid or blood within this placenta leg. Aren't you seeing that? Concentrate on this region and you will see the wide turning movement of the uh, bleed within this placental lake. Now it is quite unusual in 32 weeks gestational age. Again, you very on see that concentrate on this region. This is a placental lake. Concentrate on this region and you will see the movement of bleed within this particular placental lake. Here, this area. And this is uh, the anterior edge of the placenta. This is the lateral. And this is the posterior. This is the posterior part. Now rest all is okay, fine. No, uh, there is absolutely no problem with the fetus and uh, fetal <coughs> to be seen, growth is uh, okay by all parameters. See, it's uh, female length is 6.2, corresponding to 32 weeks gestational age, abdominal circumference 288.3 millimeter, corresponding to 32 weeks gestational age, and fetal, estimated fetal weight is 2.25 uh, kilogram, or double to five nine grams uh, so uh, so far as the weight at 32 weeks the signal age is concerned and uh, it's absolutely normal for our culture and area so the pathology the only pathology is uh, relating to the placenta how will we report it how will we uh, uh, I mean the, here with the uh, referring doctor regarding the placenta and especially uh, what this area, this area, which is uh, in, with the, in communication with the urinary bladder wall. And so this is our case of today. Thank you very much.